Hello everybody, I am the Valley Viking and today I wanted to do an update. But not only just an update, I also have a punishment that I have to go ahead and take care of. So um, first, let's go ahead and, and bring you up to date with uh, what's been going on. For the last couple of days, I don't know if you already knew this, but my video did come out that said Happy Easter. And we had a really great time, me and my daughter, we, we did a... a an egg hunt and then you can watch that here on this channel if you would like um and we went to church and we had a, a blast with uh with uh, my sister she was doing really great it was really fun um and then uh came home relaxed had a great great day um and then yesterday we started work on our backyard to go ahead and fix it up so this way we can install a new shed so uh, been currently trying to move rocks around and get rid of weeds and doing things and um, well, you can you can take a look now So that's kind of what we've been going through. Um, now, uh, because of both of those things, I really haven't had time to do the punishment that I had said three days ago. Um, so uh, today, I'm going to be taking care of that punishment. Um, the punishment was four because I did not get more than 90% correct on my, my last trivia that I did so uh and and I really I want to keep I want to keep a man of my word I want to be a man of my word so um I got two more wrong than I was supposed to get so I thought I would go ahead and come to Google or YouTube or kind of look around for some punishments or something um and then I, I came across um, a really simple one, which I hadn't thought about before, which is um, looking up foods that don't really belong together, but do belong together. Um, some of them are trolling. Some of them are real. Uh, so, I mean, for what, what better punishment than to do a food uh, taste test, right? I mean, I, I love taste testing, so let's, let's do it. Um, and, uh, of course, I haven't been shopping for a long time, and I didn't have time to go get a punishment anyway. So, uh, instead, I got stuff that I had on hand that uh, would be pretty good. Now, the first thing I have is something that everybody opens a little differently, and um, uh, everybody has, like, a, a kind of... What do you call it? Uh, 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 they like it or they don't, right? Uh, all or not. And um, this one's a little old, so it's it's gonna be um, it's it's not bad, but it's not great, and it's not really that old, but it's beyond my liking. Anyway, that is the banana. Now most people open it from this side. I don't know if you knew that or not. Um, you can just crack it open right here and then it opens up. Me, per personally, I, I like going from the bottom because it's so much easier to just, you know, pinch and peel. 
and then right like that. Now, I think I've mentioned this before on this channel. Not too sure. It's been a long time since I've said anything about bananas. <laughs> um, but okay. Now, this is going to be accompanied by something that you would not normally eat these with. Now, there we go. My first one that I want to go ahead and try with this, because there's two different taste tests, and both of them say that they're pretty good. I don't know if one of them's a troll. I don't know. Um, let's go ahead and start off with one that I thought would be interesting, um, and that is ketchup. <laughs> now, the ketchup I have is not exactly normal ketchup. It's sriracha ketchup. And... Um, not sure how spicy sweet and tomato might go well um it, it sounds pretty good usually acids and, and sweets pair well very well and so do spice so let's see oh a few moments later ketchup Oof. Oof. Hmm. Interesting. At some point in the very beginning, it tasted really bad. Like, no lies, it, it was ugh. But after tasting it for a little bit, it reminded me of a vegetable, honestly. It made me think of like, um, uh, kind of kidney beanish, or maybe even like it's maybe a bean more more likely. Um, definitely not one that I'd be going back to though. A very interesting flavor, almost made me throw up. But uh, whatever, yo. <laughs> All right, my second punishment is the, it's my personal favorite thing to have in the house, um, and I think we should never run out of it, and that is mustard. Now, a lot of people, they don't like mustard, and um, I don't know why. I love mustard. But banana mustard? Mm. I don't know. Okay. There we go. Punishment number two. Three, two, one. Honestly, both of those condiments by themselves are pretty good. Oh, my belly said, what are you doing? They're good on other foods. On a banana, the banana, whew, I don't know. I don't hate it, but I don't like it either. Oh. <sighs> It kind of leaves a lingering, a lingering sweet taste. There is kind of a potato niche to that, to that flavor. I don't, yeah, don't think I'll be eating that again. Let's just say both of those might have been a troll. So, uh, I mean, it doesn't taste bad don't taste good if it was the last food on the earth i guess i could eat both of those and it'd be okay all right that was my punishment thank you so much for watching i hope that you enjoyed the video if you did leave a like and um 
stay tuned for the next video and try to beat the quiz that I have going um, next time. I I really want to win one of those. And then I could get a reward. I really want a reward. All right. Until next time. Have a good night, everybody. Bye-bye.